Hi guys, it's me you and I'm back. So actually, hindi naman kami lumabas no early week, so dito lang kami talaga sa metro. Since late na rin para magplan ng anything else because medyo busy naman ako and si Kev this past few days. So yan, what we decided to do is nag stay here na lang sa condo and did activities on our own. So yan, buti na lang wala masyadong foot traffic dahil everyone's out of the Manila and the city. So usually yung mga friends namin nasa Japan, Taiwan, or Korea na nakikita namin sa IG stories nila. So kami, nag-swimming na lang kami here sa condo. Buti na lang, binuksan nila yung amenities. So yung gym, yung pool, everything's open, yung play park. So yan, nag-enjoy naman yung kids. So after nga, in-invite namin yung in-laws ko and yung girlfriend ng brother-in-law ko. So yan, nag-short picnic lang kami dito sa baba with yung grandmother namin. And then, the next day, nagkaroon din kami ng e-house session with some friends here sa condo. So, of course, kanya-kanyang dala kami na. So, ako yung nakatutok sa dessert. And then, some of the guys, sila yung nakatutok sa e-how. Yan. Even si Kev, tumulong din siya. And then, yung kids, well, nag i yung mga guys. And then, yung girls, nagsiset up ng table. Yung mga kids naman, nagpa-play dun sa play park. So, nakakatuwa. Actually, late na nga kami nag-start. Mga 6pm or 7pm na kami nag-start. Kasi we were waiting for our other friend. Galing pa straight from Batangas. And then yung other friend niya. Yeah, straight, other friend namin. Straight from Bulacan pa. So, medyo natagalan kami mag-start. But yan, yeah, overall, it was fun. And kwentuhan. Yeah, catch up lang. So, happy naman everyone. And may take home pa kami. Kasi hindi naubos lahat. I just went to the gym, so for two days straight, the uh, gym lang ako, and then to get him some sweat, and para makabawi din sa mga kinain from the holidays. So yeah, open and walking lang kami in the gym. And then on Black Saturday, before on Easter Sunday, we decided to get some presents lang. For ako, I just got my mom and yung in-laws ko ng some presents lang and also my friends. So, chocolates and then from our row cafe while the kids are in BGC. So, actually, pupunta dapat kami sa Adventure Zone in BGC but hindi nagkasundo yung sa time ng friend ko na member. Kasi kuntin, kapag sa Adventure Zone in Shangri-La, level 6, by the way, may sarili silang elevator. <laughs> Nakatuwa. So, anyway... So, kapag contingent yung time mo as a guest, doon sa length ng stay ng member. So, if the member is only gonna stay for 30 minutes, but you have to pay yung set uh, payment nila, which is like 800 pesos. So, I didn't think it was really sulit at that point and didn't give that much value to my money. So, what I did was I just left left my kids there at Active Fun so with a with the helpers. And then, I just went to Aru Cafe to get some stuff lang. Tapos, I also got my kids some activity sets for the upcoming Easter. So, the next day Easter na. So, we had a mass here in our building. Short activity lang. And then, yeah, after the mass, nag-Easter egg hunt na yung kids. So, nag-rush everyone yung mga kids just to find the most eggs. So, yung bigger eggs, meron silang special prizes. Did early, or I think it was around 9 a.m. Because there was a program na short potluck lang after that in our small community so yeah and so we were able to get around 20 eggs i think so yeah and then dumiretso na kami because we had lunch with the in-laws in podium mom goes to level three podium mall easter lunch a sit down the meal in bon gusto restaurant which is located in the third floor of the podium mall so what this they serve is a casual sit down dining area so it's by the vikings group of companies and they specialize in mediterranean cuisine so meron sila mga fish ganyan fresh salads the best seller nila for me yung croquet and yung paella familiar regarding the owners the vikings group of companies also own a lot of other companies here usually mga buffet style so they own the alley they own new they own tongyang and they own four seasons buffet so it's very spacious when you go inside and they were very accommodating, the waiters were very accommodating and everyone was very helpful. For starters, we actually had their grilled squid, so it's I think the total cost for that dish is around 430 pesos, more or less.
So it's just a simple grilled quid dish with lemon, olive oil, parsley, and garlic. Of their best recommendations from the menu, so we got their grilled fish, and we also had their paella negra, and their chicken, which was so good. And then one of their dishes was, I think it's pork. So yon, they're under mashed potato siya. So I wasn't really able to take much photos during the course of the lunch because I was heading to another event. So actually, yan, um, meron palang event, the Easter event, yung podium, as long as makakuha ka ng 5,000 worth ng purchase in any restaurant. So I actually saw their signage downstairs at the ground floor when we entered. And then I was asking them if meron pang extra slots. So good thing they were able to give us one slot. So nag-chance lang kami talaga. Chance on kami. And then yeah, nabigyan kami ng extra slot. So I got the receipt from Bon Gusto. So I think our total bill was So I think our total bill was around 75 including na yung discounts ng senior citizen namin and UPWD ni Kev. So anyway, going on. So actually umakyat kami dyan, and then this was located at the level 6 of the Podium Mall in Mandaluyong City. So yeah, umakyat kami doon and then nakita ni Kaden nga yung mga backpack. So we asked in entrance, we gave them the receipt from our restaurant. And then there, my activity area sila specifically for kids. So there's a basketball area, an arts and crafts, a balloon making contest. And then meron din silang mag magic show with a magician. But we didn't go na sa magic show kasi super dami ng tao as in crowded na yung area. And then on the rightmost side of the stage or the whole parang convention area, so there were actually vendors where you could actually buy stuff. So I think there was Auntie Anne's. We got uh, some safari-themed animals from... Toys R Us, which is around 400 pesos. So, plastic toys lang siya. So, Kaden took it home. And then, merong artwork. And then, na iko complete ka. After you complete the artwork, they would then give you an egg, which you could actually, you know, design on your own. You could paint it. And there were teachers that were guiding. So, there would be teachers that would be roaming around and guiding you along the way on how you would proceed with your project. So, yan. Maramid and stage parents and andon, just like me. So, yeah, nag, nag help out sila sa kids. I think the activity area was more for the bigger kids, like the painting and yeah, the arts and crafts. So it was more for the bigger kids to appreciate, but like for toddlers like Kaden, they couldn't really appreciate it that much yet. But anyway, overall, it was a good activity for me. So we distract kami and grab yung energy ng kids. So they were, were running around the place. They were all over the place. So afterwards, we just stayed in the mall because they... We had a quick meeting lang. I mean, Kev and Dad. So they had a quick meeting lang. And then, yeah, we just stayed there, I think, around until 6. So we just had coffee and some cake and dessert at Kiru's Coffee afterwards. We, When we actually finished with this event, it was around almost 3 p.m. So we just stayed. We went straight to Kiru's Coffee lang. And then, yeah, just reunited with the fam. In Kira's coffee, we just had their ube champurado, so nag half lang kami ng bibi ko. And then I had their affogato coffee because I didn't really know what to pick, and I just thought that it looked nice. So, yeah, and there's how we spent Easter. Thanks for watching. <laughs>